Welcome back everyone. I'll go ahead and show you exactly how to set up any photo that you have as a widget on iOS 14. So first of all, make sure you're updated to iOS 14. Now what you want to do is the process is pretty easy. It will require you to install an app. So what you want to do is you want to make your way over to the app store and you want to download this specific app, which is called widget Smith. So all you want to do is just type it in like this and you just want to download this specific one. Now this one is blowing up. So a ton of people are probably going to download it. It's probably going to take a minute. So go ahead and install it. And like I said, it'll probably take a second or two for it to fully install. Now, once it's installed, all you want to do is hop out of your specific app store and you want to make your way over to your photo gallery. So right here is where you want to select the specific photo that you want as a widget. So in this case, we'll go ahead and go over, let's just say we want this as our, you know, specific widget photo. What we want to do is we want to basically add this to its own album. So we want to keep this as its own album. We don't want to keep it anywhere else. So what we're going to do is we're going to click this share button right here. We're going to go scroll down and we're going to click add to album. So now we're going to create a new album with that photo. So we're going to go and click new album and you just want to name it whatever you want to. So in this case, we'll just name it this. It really doesn't matter. And you want to go ahead and click save. So once it saves, you're pretty much all set. Now I'm going to go ahead and exit out of the widget Smith app so then we can kind of go from the beginning. So now what we want to do is we want to find that widget Smith app. So right there it is. You want to go ahead and open it. Now, once you're here, you'll probably come to a page that's something like this. Now, what you want to do is you want to add a small widget. You can also do a medium or big size widget if you want to. But in this case, we'll just handle the small one for sure for now. So you want to click add small widget and then you want to select this one of these empty ones. As you can see, the first one I did, it worked here. You want to go and click this one, the small number two, for example, whichever one you just added and you'll come to this page. Now, what you want to do is you want to click right here and you'll come into this page. Now, what you want to do here is you want to scroll all the way down until you find a photo and album. So once you see that, all you want to do is go and click on it. A little thing will come down. You want to go and click select album. And then right here is where you can select that specifically new album that we just had. So as you can see, this is the new one we just had. This is the previous one I had. This is the new one. So we can go ahead and click on it. And it should take a second, I think. Or you can just go ahead and click back here right there. And as you can see, we are pretty much good. As you can, as long as you can see that one image there, then you're set. You want to go and click save and you're pretty much good to go. So all you want to do now is hop all the way out and you want to make your way into this panel. So it'll look something like this. You want to scroll all the way down. You want to click edit. You want to click the plus button, which is up here. And now when you're here, you want to scroll all the way back down and you will see widget Smith right down here. So what you want to do in this case, you want to go and click widget Smith and you'll see a couple of small widgets and you'll see the medium widgets and you'll see the large widget. What you want to do is you want to be hovered over small widgets. You want to go and click add widget. You'll see it right here. Now, once you see that widget right here, all you want to do is you want to hold down on it. Once you select it, you'll see edit widget. So what you want to do is you want to go and click edit widget and you'll come into this panel. So all you want to do here is click that specific icon and click the specific one that you just did. So as you can see, I did small number two earlier. I can go and click it, hop out, and as you'll see, I have that image right there. So all I have to do now is drag this image out onto the front panel and I can drag it literally wherever I want to. In this case, I'll go ahead and drag it where that other image is. As you can see, it's glitching up. And after some rearranging, there we go. So as you can see, I have this Apple one right here and I have the TikTok one right here. And that's really pretty much the process. You can just rinse and repeat only add one specific photo to an album. Don't add multiple ones unless you want like an alternating photo one, but that's really pretty much it. If you guys have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that means so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really does count. So me so much if you guys can hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my main channel. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.